blessing, guidance, and protection to all my viewers and subscribers. People, the news had report about this lady from London, England, who have been missing in Jamaica. 63 years old, Claudette Wilson, Beaumont of Ardale Close, Southwest London, has been missing in Jamaica since Wednesday, November 11th. She is of brown complexion, slim built, and about 168 centimeters, 5 feet 6 inches tall. Reports from the New Kingston Police are that Wilson Beaumont was last seen at a hotel in Kingston. Her mode of dress at the time she went missing is unknown. All efforts to contact her since then have been unsuccessful. Anyone knowing the whereabouts of Claudette Wilson Beaumont is being asked to contact the New Kingston Police at 876 926 3508 or 119 or the nearest police station. People, have you seen this lady? Anyone who can assist the police to find this lady, please do so. It is very hard to, you know, spend in your vacation and expect to return home and then your family to hear that you're missing. No one knows what happened. Please call the nearest police station if you see this lady. People, I don't know what is happening in Jamaica, but when it's not one thing, it's the other. All kind of things is happening there. There, a lot of people went missing and then sometime, you know, they turn up dead. You hear nothing more, right? If these people are whoever, they could release this lady. And I wish and pray that all these things would stop. But it's seen as if it's not going to stop for now unless the government takes some drastic action concerning these missing persons. There's so much person gone missing in Jamaica. From a hotel that, you know, she should be in a secure place, but nobody knows what happened. There's another person there on the screen who is missing recently. He's Damian Thompson, a 35 year old Damian Thompson a chef of Bart Fountain District and Newland Road in Yala St. Thomas has been missing since Saturday, November 7. He is of dark complexion and thick build. Reports from the Yala's police station are that about 6 a.m. on November 7, Thomas was last seen and Highbury Crescent in Morant Bay, St. Thomas, wearing a black shirt, black pants, and a pair of black shoes. Anyone knowing the whereabouts of Damian Thomas is being asked to contact the Yellows Police Station at 876-982-5075 or 119 or the nearest police station. People. Again, if anyone see this gentleman or know the whereabouts of this gentleman, please call the police so that his family, his friends, you know, can be happy and not thinking of the worst. You know, this is really, really hard. People can be just missing and then Nobody know the whereabouts, nobody know what happened. Sometimes people might, yeah, run off and do, go hide or whatever, but most time it's like, like that. So if you see this man on the screen there, 
or that lady before anywhere you call the police call the police so that the police can take action Jamaica need the people in Jamaica who are doing all these wrongs need to stop need to stop because you might get away today but somehow tomorrow or soon the police gonna caught up with you every day you keep doing the same thing don't believe that you're gonna be successful always you're gonna put to rest they're gonna caught up with you people Again, I beseech you, if you see these two persons or any of the missing persons before, you should call the police. Do it in a discreet manner because you don't want to be hurt. You don't want anyone to come and destroy you for reporting. So you got to be smart when you do your report. People, uh, the, the Kaelan, Kaelan Dowdy, that is in the hospital, you know, she's still in a coma. Remember that video I did about Kaelan Dowdy, who was beaten by, they said six first, but now it's five women. Um, the police have caught up with the five women, two turning themselves at first, and the other three who was in hiding, the police have them in custody now. They have been charged, people. The hyenas, the piranos, the demonic forces have been charged. These are the names of the five women who are in custody for trying to take out Kaelan. 17 year old Kaelan. She is still in coma, people. Big woman. The first one is 26 year old sales representative, Christian Lewis. 22 years old waitress, Timon Williams. 28 year old call center representative Shakima McLeod 45 year old 45 people 45 mercy Kaelan is 17 years old slim built look at that little person and when you see she come on the screen there 45 year old laborer Yoland Vassal and 33 year old Nadine Aldridge unemployed people I I can't look at the age group people she's 17 26 22 28 45 and 33 these are big grown women who should be who should know better who have children what had got people i am forced to say they are piranos you know those piranos anything that they catch they just tear it apart because what could have gotten into their head to do a small look at her look at kayla no? to destroy what kind of demonic force in those people well, the police have them in custody and they have been charged. And I know that justice will be served for Kaelan. A lot of people is relief. People who are praying for Kaelan recovery, I am praying for her also. That the Most High God will touch her body from head to toe. Jehovah Rapha God will put his healing hand upon Kaelan work a miracle upon her so that she will completely heal